Hi, today I am going to make Veronica speed bell, a very pretty flower, very easy to make. Materials required are grey paper in green, white, pink, a thin wire and thick wire. All measurements are in centimeter. This is the stencil for the bud. This is 2.5 high and 1.5 centimeters wide. Cut about 15 pieces. This is of the petal. This is 2 centimeters high and 3 centimeters high on top. Uh, sorry, wide on top and 1.75 at the base. Cut about 15 pieces. This is of the leaf. This is the bigger leaf. So this is 6.5 centimeters high by 1.5 centimeters. The stem is 1.5 by half a centimeter. The smaller leaf is 5 cm high and 1 cm wide. The stem is 1.25 by half a cm. Cut a strip about 1.5 cm wide and stretch it. Now take some green floral tape, just a little bit. Stretch this also. Take the thick wire and wind this tape on top. On one end of the wire. Now take this strip, fold it, cut about half of it. On the fold and just give cuts halfway of the strip. Okay, that's a firecracker. Like this. So I'll cut along the whole length. So open this. Apply glue on the base. Take the thick wire and start winding on it. So first just you know roll it at the same spot a couple of times and then very slowly go down so you don't you know just don't go down immediately, go slowly at a time. You have to cover about 3 centimeters of the wire, thick wire. I didn't mention the length of the strip because it depends on you how you roll it. Basically, you have to just cover the wire about three centimeters of it. So this is how it will look. I'll just ruffle it up a bit. So this is what it looks like. For the bud, just turn it over and apply glue on the base and just fold it. First just one third and the other side also. So you get a shape like this. This way I have made quite a few. I have cut another strip 
from the green paper this is about 2 cm wide so I have made cuts on it and I haven't stressed it so on this I'm just going to you know stick these these buds with the open side towards you so just stick some glue and start sticking it so first it will be you know at the same height as a strip so first few will be like this leave about uh, half a centimeter between each and then gradually just you know protrude it above the strip So eventually it will come at the same height at the base as a strip. So I will stick up these. So I have stuck about 14 of these. Now just apply glue on the base of the strip. Take the thick wire so start minding and going down slowly. Try to again cover about uh, 3 centimeters of the wire. Now I have cut a strip of uh, from the white paper. This is about 1.75 centimeters wide so now on an one end first just make a slit about halfway of the strip cutting a very thin strip and then again and cut it the whole way so what you get is a strip like this you know with a divided top so now just take the strip for the petal and use these serrated as scissors just cut off the right side like so then using scissors or anything first just curl the top and stretch the middle portion a bit like so take this strip that we made white strip 
apply glue on it and stick it in the center of the petal and it should be slightly actually at the same height as the petal like this apply glue on one end roll over the paper and stick the other end on it open out the flower this is what it looks like again I have made quite a few take a slightly long piece from the floral tape stretch it first just wind it at the base of the buds that we would made earlier of times now take these flowers and just put one flower at a time and wind the tape So put as many flowers as you want covering about 4 centimeters of the wire. So for the leaf using these scissors just cut off the sides so you get this or you can manually cut it if you wish. So I made about 4 leaves for this. First, just wind a bit of the tape. Now, take the leaf and score it in the center and then curve it. So, it looks like this. So, I'll do with the other three also. Just put a leaf and put another one right opposite. So it has opposite leaves actually. Unwind a bit and then put two more leaves. Another one opposite to this. So you have for the small spike. Just cut a piece of thin, uh, sorry, thin wire. This is about 12 to and a half centimeters long. 
Now take some green tape. And bind the thin wire completely with this. Now again cut a strip in the same way, in the same width. So just apply glue. And starting from the top, first just wind it a couple of times on the top. So you get that blunt top and then very slowly go down covering about 2 cm of the wire. When I say 2 cm, 2 cm of these, uh, you know, these strips, not the close side. So just measure it. So this should do it. So you have a spike like this. Now I have these small leaves and a couple of big ones. So take the tape. Stretch it. So first you have to curve the leaves. I don't know why I'm forgetting today. But So take the thin ones, the small leaves and attach it the same way as we did for the main flower stem. So you will have opposite ones. And then two more so it will form like a, a rosette. big ones So just arrange the leaves, they should be opposite to each other. Like so. So just take a slightly long piece of the floral tape. Stretch it. I'm just going to attach this here. So just hold it next to the stem and mine the tape on it so just open it out a bit put it at an angle like this now you can open out these flowers also. So just bend them out. I 
or you can use scissors also to open them out. And then the buds also. So this is how a stem would look.